All right, welcome back to some more Wind Waker uh, HD. Um, hero, hero mode. Yay. Um, last time we went through Forsaken Fortress, did not get caught. Still haven't taken any damage either, surprisingly a little bit. Not too much, really. And it would be ironic if the first thing that caused me to get damaged was that pig over there, but, um... Let's continue. Shall we? Okay. Yes, Windfall Island. Look at that punk kid right there. Ooh, look at me strut. Mm, mm, I'm so cool. Look at me with the cool kids. Mm, okay. Um, this is going to be the last time I think I record for the day. I think what I'll do is I will put two... Oh! Oh, if you please, young boy there, please help me. Please listen to my tale of woe. Ew, no. Fine. Oh, ho, ho, my sweet, sweet daughter. My only daughter. Poor Maggie. She was captured by a bunch of villains and taken to the Forsaken Fortress. What on earth could those scoundrels want with her? Are they just roaming around, looking for young maidens? Are they just evil creatures who delight in mischief? Well, crud! Having a kidnapped daughter doesn't get you a single rupee, you know. Please, please save my poor daughter. I beg of you. Play here, I stand begging. I hope you'll give those scoundrels on the Forsaken Fortress a good scare. Oh, I bet you will. They'll pay for what they've done. Oh, yes, pay with rupees. Yeah, whatever, you crazy old man. Okay, I know where to go. But I forget if he sells you it immediately, because I'm pretty sure he's... My story is a strange one. I came across a cursed seas from a land far away. A land where the blizzards blow violently, heading for this town called Windfall. Dear me, my ship was torn apart by vicious winds, and this island is where I washed ashore. There was one per other person with me. Yes, there was. But I dare say, he was immediately arrested based on his somewhat suspicious looks and thrown right into jail. Yes, just locked up somewhere on this island. Needless to say, I'm really worried about him. Would you be so kind as to help him, help free him from his captivity? Indeed, it would be appreciated. Sell me a freaking sail! Okay, I... It's been a while, apparently, since I... I don't remember quite... Is it this way? Go away, you kids! Freaking brats. Um... Is it this way? I forget what's... What's over here? What's in here? Um... This doesn't look like... Oh, I remember that. I remember that. You see those shiny vases over there? Yeah, I don't want to break those or else the the guy in here gets all mad and ticked off and pretty much wants to get like 20 rupees each out of for each one that you break or something. Um, hmm. Well, I know that. Oh, shoot. This is the bomb shop, isn't it? I can't read, uh, Hi Hylian, or whatever language this island's. I forget if this is Hylian or not. That's the bomb shop. It's making that noise. Hey, can I b buy some bot bombs? 
This be the bomb shop. Go on and look around. Come on, ten bombs. Ten thousand rupees. Come on now. How's a kid like you going to pay for these? You're dreaming, bub. Twenty bombs. Twenty thousand rupees. Look, can't you read? Do these look like something you can afford? <laughs> Thirty bombs. Thirty thousand rupees. Listen to me, boy. You're out of your freaking mind. You can't pay for these. So scram. My ancestors been making bombs for generations. Uh huh. Now seems like I'm the only person left in the world who still works in the bomb industry. Which means I'm the best in the world. And which means I don't go selling my work without approving of who I sell to. And I don't approve of you. So beat it! I want that. Um, you don't have enough cash, do you? No. Didn't think so. Do you expect me to sell my fine bombs to some boy who has no money? Ha! I'm done with you. Beat it. Scram. Yours. You are... I didn't call for you, boy. Go on now. Beat it. God, what a freaking grouch. Uh, so there's the creepy old guy. There's the uh, Eskimo guy that's trying to find... That sent me to find his pal to break him out of prison. He's sending a boy to break his pal out of prison. Yeah, that's very, uh, nice. And oh, wait, I think this is the place. I remember now. Yeah, this is the place. It's gotta be it. Yeah, there. Are you serious? I forgot Tingle was his friend. part where I go, bye bye have a nice, uh, Tingle Kalimpa day. Wow. That was... Huh? There you go. Be free! Oh, boy. Yay! Hooray! Thank you all so very much. Here is Tingle's heartfelt gift of thanks. Tingle, Tingle, Queen Ba! Become an item! Get out of my spotlight! You got a Tingle bottle. Using Miiverse, you can insert a message you've written and send it out to see for someone unknown to receive. Set it to... to and... Wait, set it to and use it with... Y, X, or R. Be aware that you can't write letters if you're not connected to Meverse. Okay. Mr. Fairy, are you familiar with Meverse? No, because... I don't remember this in the original game. With it, messages put in this bottle can be sent to fairies all over the world. A communion of minds. Heart's beating as one. Heart. Just don't write anything unpleasant, okay? Not that I have to remind you, Mr. Fairy. You're a fairy. Splendid! Tingle is returning now to his own special island. Will you come find him? Ugh. What now? Ah, I was forgetting something important. Oh, Mr. Fairy. You're a fairy. You want to come to my island, don't you? Don't you? Don't you? No. Uh, you got the Tingles chart. You got Tingles chart, not the Tingles chart. What kind of chart could it be? Head out to see and check your charts on the map screen to find out. What the? Whatever. Uh, open it on the map screen. If you ever need any help with your charts, just leave it to Tingle. Don't ever forget it. Tingle, Tingle, Kulimpa. 
And if you'd like to give your Tingle Bottles that little extra oomph that all Tingles crave, you should check the back of this cell. Check it right now. Bye bye Mr. Fairy. You're a fairy. You can now send letters. Okay, I'm reading what it says on here. You can now send letters in Tingle Bottles by using Meverse. Set your Tingle Bottle to X, Y, X, or R to send a letter of your own. You can even use a picto box to include a pictograph with your message. Pick up Tingle Bottles that you find lying on beaches or floating in the sea to read letters other people have written. You can adjust your, you can adjust your message settings at any time from the settings screen. Uh, allow Tingle Bottles from Meverse. Um, yeah, anyone. Allow Tingle Bottles with spoilers. I'm going to put spoilers on because because I want to see if I get anything while doing this uh, recording. So, because, yeah, I don't... Uh, yeah, sorry. Sorry. Okay. What's in the back of the cell? Because I... I see a rupee, but how the heck do I get that rupee? That looks like... No. Can I crawl? There it is! I was about to say, how, how did I crawl again? Aha! Okay. What do we got over here? Wait. This is not... I remember this. There's a rat. I don't think I want to go that way. Please don't be a rat. Okay, good. Don't be a rat. Don't be a rat. Whoa, 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 whoa. There's a rat, see? You see that rat? No, you don't want to go that way. Are you freaking insane? See that rat? Yeah, if you end up at a dead end, pretty much a rat will come out and... Don't be a bat. Actually, no, I'm not taking the chance. I know what I can do. I know what I can do. Go straight. Maybe. Ah, you can even see the plank right there. I'm not getting caught by a rat. Screw that. That's a rat. Aha! Treasure! Wait. If this is a if this is a heart piece, I'm gonna be mad. So I'm saving. I'm saving because I I don't want no friggin' heart piece. Do I look like I want a heart piece? Cool. Okay, picto box. Okay, cool. Can set it with that and can record up to twelve pictographs. Like in the original game, or in Majora's Mask, where you can only take one. Okay, let's show you what happens if you get caught by a rat. Just in case anyone doesn't know, this is what happens. And then you get dropped in the ocean. Oh, 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 oh. oh hello. Give him the stick. Don't... Wait. Give him the stick? Don't give him the stick. What? That's what the bo... And... Spoilers. I, I won't say where it's from. Just... That's what it says, because, yeah, it does tell you where 
the message is from, but I'm not gonna say where that message is from. Okay, let's go to Mr. Eskimo and try to get that back. Really? You have rescued him? That is news I deem rather great. You end up, you are one stand-up individual. Indeed you are. Now, I apologize, as I have, but another favor. Another favor? Seriously? I'm actually considering starting up a little shop here on the island, but I'm having trouble funding my venture. I have but one asset to my name. I wonder if you might buy it from me, perhaps. The people on this island have no interest in venturing out into these dangerous seas, so my chance of selling it to them is rather bleak. The bleakest I can describe. I'd really like to ask 200 rupees for it, but as a favor for rescuing my friend, perhaps we may strike a deal. How does 80 rupees sound? I'll take it. That, I was afraid you were going to say 200. But yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you very much indeed. I have received precisely 80 rupees for it. I can use these funds to finance my new business. Oh, dear me, dear me, what a happy day. Very well, young master. As I promised, please take that. Take that. Objection. You got a boat seal. Sweet. Yes, yes, yes. You have made a good purchase today, my young master. And you have saved my life and business as well. Treasure it dearly. It is the finest sale in the world. Treat it as such. Cool. I got a sale. I can get out of here whenever I want, but... Before we do that... Wait, what? Oops. Wrong, uh... Wrong button. Um... Before we do that, what? What's in here? I forget what's in here. Seriously, what 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 be in here? Oops. Welcome. Oh my, you're a very small customer, aren't you? Well, that's fine, of course. Just feel free to look around. Um. Got anything? Oh, can I help you with something? Eh, yeah, maybe next time. Well, bye. I don't feel like talking. Because I think I know what to do next. But I want a bottle. I can't remember where the bottles are in this game. Right? Like I said, it's been a while. Can I get a bottle from the potion person? Because I know the potion person's in here. Hello, hello, and hello! You are standing in the one and only Choo Jelly Juja. Juice Sop. You must have heard. Our potions are the best. I'm telling you, they're too good. In fact, they're absolutely incredible. Huh? What's that? What's Choo Jelly? You ask, looking somewhat bewildered. Oh, sir, you simply must be joking. You don't know what chew jelly is? Actually, I do know what it is, but you're going to tell me what it is anyway, aren't you? Well, just ask yourself this, good sir. What is a robustly nourishing element? What is a mystical substance that is good for the body and mind? Ask yourself! The words chew jelly roar out in answer to these questions, proclaiming themselves to be true. Why, it is the key ingredient in the most effective potions around. All you have to do is bring an empty bottle to my juice shop here, and I'll let you have a taste, which begs the question, Sir, do you have an empty bottle? No. No. Okay. Can I... Can, can you give me an empty bottle, please? Hmm? What? Don't tell me you don't have an empty bottle. I can't sell you any potion if you don't have something to carry it in. It's not my law. It's the law of physics! Ah! Shut up. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! Okay. 
I forget where a bottle is, and I do... I think the... I don't want to talk to you. Shut up. I don't care if you're a jerk. Um, I think I know where the first bottle is, and I can't... I have to continue on, and... Oh, no. What do we got here? Found Tingle. Yes, you did. Yes, you did. You found Tingle. Any other bottles? Nothing. Don't see any other bottles. Oh, that look in your eye. So you've found yourself a sail, have you? Very well. Then I shall teach you the art of sailing. Come next to my hull and press A to climb aboard. Hoist the sail you got with the A to get moving. The sail will catch the wind, which will push the boat forward. The arrow that appears behind me indicates the wind direction. Use the L to steer. If you wish to move quickly, you should keep the wind blowing directly into the sail. You can always press B to put the sail away. Try it when you want to adjust speed. Did you understand? Yeah, sure. Oh, one more thing. When you are out at sea with few landmarks to go by, you will be at the mercy of your sea chart. I have marked the place where we should currently be heading for your sea chart. If you get lost at sea, select the map displayed on your Wii gamepad. Open the chart, blah, blah, blah. Confirm your position. Now, a westerly bl wind blows. Hop in and let it carry us to the east. Okay, let's uh, set sail. We, we, we. All right. Cool. Now, how do I go faster? Isn't this how uh, speedrunners do it? Pretty sure that's how they did it. Wow, it looks so bright. And that music. Oh man, that brings me back. Yeah, this music. Oh man, it brings me back to when I was 12. App. Okay, what do we got over here? What is that? Like over there. I have no idea what that is. Um, isn't there something I can do with this island? Yeah, there it is. Put away. There we go. Fall in the hole. Pretty sure there's chew jelly in here. Open any chest. Look at that. Yeah! Got some red shoe jelly. Cool. Yeah, red shoes. It is effective as a cure for exhaustion, but it can't be used in its current state. Yeah, I know. No. No. Even more chew jelly because. That's pretty much why I came in here. That and rupees, I guess. But I don't know what chests would hold rupees and what ones would hold... ...heart pieces that I don't want. Because you all know what I feel about heart pieces. Yeah, that's a heart piece, I bet. It just screams heart piece. 
Just screams it. I ain't picking that up. Screw that. I really, I, I'm really curious as to what's inside it, but no, I'm not picking it up. I, I don't feel like restarting it. Someone's gonna be like, in the comments too. It wasn't a heart piece, Luke. It was, it was rupees. You could have picked that up and had more rupees. Well, uh, gotta remember, it's been a while since I played this. I was in here pretty much for the chew jelly. Because usually secret islands like this are not good for, like, that's how you get heart pieces. But it could have a tre treasure tre uh, map in it too, that's why I wasn't sure. How did you get all that way out here? Wanna leave me or something? Jeez. Okay, set sail. Yeah! Mighty fine boat you got there, bub! You must be searching for treasure on the seafloor too, aren't you? Ha 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 ha! You won't get any from us, bub, not likely. Let me ask you something real quick. Who wanders around on a fishless sea? I'll tell you who, bub. Only pirates, monsters, and treasure hunters like ourselves. And maybe some other things that I've never heard of. Uh, yeah. Maybe a hero or two or something, but ah, that's unlikely. Yeah, see? I even got my posse saying, uh-huh. You know, with all the weak island dwellers who never leave their shores, I'm amazed to see such a tiny little guy out here. I like your style, bub. I feel like I've known you my whole life. So, hey, bub, tell you what. As one treasure hunter to another, I'll give you this. You'll definitely be needing it if you want to haul up that treasure, bub. Come on, take it. I won't accept no for an answer. I also won't take a nay, a nope, or nar. Just grab it. Cool. Too bad I don't have a claw. First, open your map and you on the Wii U pad. And then compare the island charts on the right with the treasure charts on the left to see where treasure lies. If you press plus to pause the game, you can take a, your sweet time pouring over the charts. After all, haste makes waste. <laughs> After that, all you need to do is use the same thing we use to haul up treasure. One of those grappling hooks that the Rito tribes folk of Dragon Roost Island use. Yeah, those grappling hooks. Nothing pulls up stuff like those things. Oh, yeah. <laughs> all right, little treasure buddy. Best of luck to all of us. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Okay. Um, set sail. I want a rupee. Rupee. Rupee get. I want... Come on. Come on. That's a lot of rupees right there. No! Oh, where are you going, bud? How do I sail like... No! Stop! Okay, get out. I want up this. The water's probably gonna push me up. Nope. Wow, that was a surprise. I want up here. What is up here? Oh. Got ourselves a lookout area, eh? Let's sneak up. Let's see if we can sneak up, sneak up, sneak up, sneak up. And... Yaw! That was probably not a good idea. I just No, where are you going, bud? Link, you kind of got off the platform too easily right there. And I actually didn't mean to kill him like that. I I probably should learn better than to do that or know better than to do that. Come on. No, you don't want to jump off. 
Okay, give me something good. Give me something good. That's not something I want. Ooh. Ooh. Nice. I forget, does... I'm pretty sure it doesn't change night and day until, like, later in the game. Off. Oh, well, that wasn't gonna help, anyways. Yeah, I think my rule is going to be no touching random treasure chest unless I know what's inside of it. Yeah, that that map or that that sunset over there doesn't look like it's gonna be going anywhere. Um, let's uh more uh, random enemies. But let's just head towards the island while listening to the awesome music. That is the Great Bay. Wait, is it the Great Bay? I know it's the ocean music, but I can't remember the actual name of it. All I know is I'm going through these, going through that. Yeah. Let's hope for. Well, it's noon. Maybe it is changing. To what the? Hey! There was a bottle there! No! No! There on the horizon! That is our destination, Luke. Dragon Roost Island! There was an, a, a bottle there! He just made me pass the bottle. There's a bottle over there, too. High atop this island peaks, lives, lives the spirit of the skies. A great dragon by the name of Valu. You must go see this dragon and request him from him a jewel called Din's Pearl. Ask the people of the Rito tribe who inhabit this island about how to see the dragon. Oh, I almost forgot. Wait just a moment. This is the Wind Waker. It is a baton of sorts that was just used, was just used, was used long ago when the people played music in prayer to the gods. In those days, simply using it allowed one to borrow the power of the gods, but I do not know if it still works. Even so, I thought it might be of some use to you. Perhaps you should try using it. First, conduct in 3-4 time. Do not touch L. Just try to match the rhythm by tilting the right stick up, down, right. There you go. Very nice. That was splendid. Next is four, four time. Yeah, hold left to change the rhythm, then match the rhythm and tilt right stick up, right, left, down. There you go. That's it, Luke. That was not bad for your first time using the Wind Waker. Not bad at all. Well, actually, that's because... Ah, well, whatever. You can also connect with it in 6-4 time by tilting left stick right. You would do you would do well to remember that. Yeah, I got a Wind Waker. Okay. Use R to conduct. Don't tilt L to conduct. Yeah, we already know that. Okay, so... Before we go, I know people are probably going to wonder what's in this bottle, so might as well grab it. What do we got here? It's right behind me, isn't it? <laughs> oh, I wish I could show you all this. Um, I don't know if 
the screen screen's gonna take it or something. Yeah, it is. Uh, let me let me try taking the green screen off. Um, none. Yeah, that's the picture I'm seeing. It's right behind me, isn't it? Yeah, isn't that funny? That's funny. Okay. Nah, I'm good. And yeah, it says it. Like, right there, but you can't read it because it's backwards. So, let's turn the green screen back on. Okay, and yeah. Um, with that, I hope you all enjoy. And I will catch you all next time. And I enjoy going back to when I was 12. So, yeah, I hope you all are enjoying the journey, too. And, yeah, with that, have a great day.